Hello, student. Let me introduce myself first. My name is Teacher Kate. And starting today, I will be your teacher in English. Okay, so now let's proceed. So before we start, please get your book, which is The New World Five, a pencil, a pen, I mean, or a pen, and a paper. Okay, are you ready? Now let's move on. So for New World Five, we are going to talk about the unit one, which is on page four to page five. So that will be our topic for today. So as you can see, on page four, there is a, gra uh, a grammar there at the top, and we are going to talk about the simple present tense. Okay, simple present tense. When you say present tense, means what is happening? What is happening right now at the moment, today, okay? So now we have here for number one, use the simple present for form of the verb to talk about facts and general truths. Okay, so we have here, use the simple present form of the verb to talk about facts and general truths. When you say like facts and general truths means it's true, okay, it's true. For example, number one, the world is round the world is round is it is it yes it is so that is facts and general truths okay so the world is round number two we have here people use atms to get money people like means us Use ATMs to get money. Get money from the bank, from the ATM machine. Number three, the earth, the earth rotates around the sun. It's rotating around the sun. Next is stores close at 8 o'clock p.m. Okay, stores. Close at 8 o'clock p.m. Like, yeah, there are some stores that will close at 9, 10 in the evening. So those are examples for use the simple present form of the verb to talk about facts and general truths. Okay, now we have number two. So this one is number two. Number two is also... Use the simple present to describe habitual or everyday actions. Okay, everyday actions. Like, when, for example, number one, Ben works from nine to five. So Ben works, he works from nine o'clock in the morning until five o'clock in the afternoon. Like teacher Kate. Teacher Kate works from eight o'clock to four o'clock in the afternoon. Okay, so that is an example of everyday actions. Next is, I get up at seven every morning. I get up every seven. I mean, I get up at seven every morning. How about you? What time do you get up? What time do you get up? I'm going to answer. I get up at 7 every morning. I get up at 6, at 8. Okay, so what time do you get up every morning? Okay. So that is about everyday actions. Next is the simple present is also used to, to ask about facts 
and everyday actions. Okay. As means when you say as means this one is a a question. It is a question. Question mark. The simple present is also used to ask about facts and everyday actions. It's just like this one about facts and general truths, everyday actions. But now this one is for making a questions. For example, number one. Do bats sleep during the day? What do you think? Do bats sleep during the day? Yes or no? What do you think? Next is, does Mary usually take the bus to school? Does Mary usually take the bus to school? You're going to answer like, yes, she does. No, she doesn't. So that is for number three. For number four, we have here, the simple present is often used with frequency adverbs or adverbs of frequency or time expressions to say how often or how often we do things. For example, number one. How often do you exercise? How often do you exercise? Next question. How often do you eat out? Okay, how often do you exercise? I'm going to answer, I usually exercise three times a week, twice a week, or two times a week, once a week. So how often do you exercise? Next, how often do you eat out? Means outside for example you want to eat to mk to kfc so how often do you eat out so you're gonna say i eat out from time to time so i usually eat out like every day got it okay again for number one talk about facts and general truths means it's true number two everyday actions your everyday actions three is you can use this a simple present to ask like a question you can ask about facts and everyday actions and number four the simple present is often used with frequency adverbs teacher what is frequency adverbs or adverb of frequency we're gonna discuss that after this so next is we have here as i said expression of frequency so expression of frequency tell how often like we have here the very frequent and the less frequent okay again very frequent and less frequent so for very frequent we have like four examples we have here always, all the time, frequently, and normally. When you say always, it means now and then. When you say all the time, from time to time, like every day, time to time. When you say frequently, like once in a while, like once in a week, once in a month, normally, and we have here occasionally. When you say like occasionally, it's just like if birthdays, Christmas, New Year's, it's like occasionally. Less frequent, we have rarely, seldom, hardly ever, and never. Okay, so that is expression of frequency. Now let's move on. So as you can see, we have here Adverbs of frequency. When you say adverbs of frequency, an adverb of frequency tell us how often something takes place. How often? As you can see, we have here 100%, 90, 80%, 70, 50, 30, 10, 5, 0. When you say 0, never. Never. Okay, for example, number one, for always, 
I always wake up at six o'clock. I always wake up at six o'clock. When you say always, means like every day from Monday to Sunday, you always wake up at six o'clock. Next, usually, I usually come home after work. I usually come home after work. That is the use of usually. Usually is 90%. 80%, 80 percent. 80 eighty percent is normally or generally, or generally. For example, I normally swim, swim after school. I normally swim after school. Next, often. I often spend Christmas with friends. 50% sometimes, I sometimes play ten tennis on the weekend. How about you? What do you do in, on the weekend? So you're gonna say like, I always play tennis on the weekend or I usually, I normally, sometimes, just like that. 30% is occasionally, for example, I occasionally eat Vietnamese food. So during like occasions only, during occasions, I or he, she eat Vietnamese food. Next is seldom. Seldom is only 10%. I seldom go to the library. I seldom, so not really, I don't, Oh, like not that much. 5% is rarely. I rarely listen to the radio. And never means no as, as in 0%. I never listen to rock music. How about you? Have you listened to rock music? Can I answer? I never listen to rock music. Yeah. I always listen to rock music. Okay, so that is about adverbs of frequency. Again, always, usually, normally, or generally, often, or frequently, sometimes, occasionally, seldom, rarely, and never. Next is, at the down part on page four, we have letter A and letter B. For letter A, the direction says, complete the sentences using the verbs in the simple present tense. And B, make questions from the following sentences. So for letter A, it's all about the present simple tense. And for letter B, it's about the adverbs of frequency. Okay, so we have here our vocabulary, take, form, occur, bit, visit, and orbit. So that is for letter A. Says here, eat blank, take an average of 10 liters of milk to make one kilo of cheese. Eat blank an average of 10 liters of milk to make one kilo of cheese. So what do you think is the answer? Is it take, takes, taking, or took? Let's see. It takes. Let's just add letter S. Next, some sculptors blank form small statue out of clay form. What is the simple present tense of form, it's form as well. Next, hurricanes blank occur in the US every, every year. What is the simple present tense of occur? It's occur as well, because occur occurred with ED if it's in, in the past. And number four, a hummingbird blank beat its wings 50 to 200 times per second. A hummingbird blank beat its wings 50 to 200 times per second. Okay, so what is the simple present tense of beat? It's bits. Okay, next is number five, this blank 
visit five million flowers to produce half a kilogram of honey. This blank visit five million flowers to produce half a kilogram of honey. So what is the simple present tense of visit? It is visit as well. And number six, the earth blank orbit the sun at an average speed, average speed of about 30 kilometers per second. Okay, so what is the simple present tense of orbit? It's orbit. So that is for letter A. So for letter A, it's all about the simple present tense. So for simple present tense, usually we talk about the general, the general truth or facts. And also for like everyday routine and how to ask the questions. And we usually use the adverbs of frequency as well. For letter B, please hear many questions. Make. Make questions from the following sentences. So we have here, how often? Number two, what time? And usually three, how often? Four, why? Five, when? Six, how long? Seven, how many times? Eight, what or sometimes? Okay, so these are already, as you can see from one to eight, these are already the answer they are already the answers so you can make a question you will make a question for example for number one i have english classes three times a week i have english classes three times a week and then the clue here you this one will be your clue how often how often so you the i you answered with the word I, so means I'm asking you. So you're going to answer you. So let's make how often do you have English classes? Number two, I normally have dinner around eight o'clock. I normally have dinner around eight o'clock. Three, my parents go to the movies from time to time. Four, I usually go to work on the subway because it is hard to find parking. Five, my classes begin at eight o'clock in the morning. Six, it usually takes about seven hours to fly from New York to London. Seven, Jacob plays the piano in a restaurant twice a week. Eight, from time to time, Sandra goes fishing from relaxation. Okay, for number two, I normally have dinner around eight o'clock. So we are going to use this clues, like what time and usually. So you're gonna make a questions. For example is number two, what time do you usually have dinner? As you can see here, what time, this one, and usually, so what time, I change into you. What time do you usually have dinner? So that is a question, the answer for number two. Number three is how often or how often do you do your parents go to the movies? How often do your parents go to the movies? So they're gonna answer my parents go to the movies from time to time time to time. Number four, why do you usually go to work on the subway? Why? This one, why? You can say, I usually go to work on the subway because what is the reason? It is hard to find parking. Number five is when. So but when, number five, when do your classes begin? Begin means start. When do your classes begin? Number six, how long does it usually take to fly from New York to London? From New York to London, so it usually takes about seven hours to fly from New York to London. Okay. 
how many hours when they're asking about time. Number eight, how many times does Jacob play the piano? How many times does Jacob play the piano? So answer here, Jacob plays the piano in a restaurant like twice a year, twice a week, means two times a week. And number eight, what does Sandra sometimes do for relaxation? So from during or relaxation, what does Sandra do for relax relaxation? So you can say from time to time, Sandra goes fishing for relaxation. So Sandra goes fishing for relaxation. Okay, so that is for adverb of frequency. Okay, so next is we have used frequency adverbs and time expressions to say how often you do things on the list. Add your own ideas, your own idea. So we have here like go to, dent go to the dentist, exercise, talk on the phone, use my credit card, get a haircut, go dancing, go shopping, write letters, emails, or text messages, read a book, eat out, get a plate, do something stupid or dangerous. So for so you're gonna write your ideas here. So for example, I go to the dentist regularly. I go to the dentist regularly or I rarely go to the dentist. Or you're gonna say, I usually read a book. Okay, so as you can see the chart, here we have always, usually, normally, gener <clears throat> or generally, often, frequently, sometimes, occasionally, seldom, rarely, and never. So those are your choices for adverbs of frequency. Then you're gonna make a example sentences or your idea. So you are the idea. Okay, so you're gonna choose here. Use my credit card, talk on the phone, exercise. Like I always do exercise. So that is for adverbs of frequency. So you're gonna make your own idea. So next one, before I will end our topic, you will have your homework. So your homework is on your New World Five student book, please answer page five, letter D. So that will be your homework for today. So if you have any questions, you can just ask me, message me online so that I could answer it. And I will be willing to help you like every day. So goodbye students. Thank you so much. I hope you understood our topic for today. Bye-bye.